So all right, e-bikers, welcome back to Green Motion. So one of the things I've had people ask me about lately is whether I think e-bikes are a good idea for kids. And with Christmas coming up here pretty soon, this seems like it would be a good topic to cover. And for those of you who know my ex, Kelly, she is actually going to let me borrow two of her kids today. And we're going to let them try out one of our e-bikes and see what they think of it. So hang tight, guys. We're checking out whether e-bikes are good for kids right after this. So the first thing you guys need to think about is the laws in your state, of course. So Washington State, where I live, just recently eliminated the age restrictions on class one and class two e-bikes. So class three e-bikes are still 16 and older, but right now, class one and twos are available for any age kids. So, I mean, I was one of the people who was a little bit hesitant about it. I mean, the idea of, um, you know, nine or 10 year old being able to get on a bike that goes 20 miles an hour with a throttle seems a little bit dangerous, but when you look at the real epidemic that American kids are facing today with childhood obesity, I say if it gets them excited enough to want to get up and get outside and do something, get off the phones, get away from the Xboxes, I think that in itself is actually a great success. So it is going to depend on the bike you're looking at. If the state you're living in does allow kids to have e-bikes, my rule of thumb would be maybe 50% above their age as far as the speed of the bike you're looking at. So I think an eight-year-old, 12 miles an hour would probably be about a reasonable, you know, um, limit for that. Once you get to be about 10, maybe a 15 mile an hour. The main thing is you can't have that speed limit so low that the kids aren't able to keep up with their other friends who don't have e-bikes, you know, who just got regular bikes. So this T18 we're looking at today actually has a 15.5 mile an hour speed limit and Kelly's two kids are 11 and 13. So that was just about, I think, a pretty good speed limit average for these two kids. But we did go down to the neighborhood park here at the elementary school, let them hop on it and cruise it around the field some. So let's go on down and take a look and see whether or not they thought the e-bikes was something that'd be good for them. So, all right, guys, as you can see, they were having just about as much fun on that e-bike as I was. And I would say the same thing as Skippy Peanut Butter. It is kid-tested, mother-approved. And then one thing that is a big advantage on a little tiny e-bike like that is, even if you are going 15 miles an hour, which might seem kind of quick, you know, for an 11, 12-year-old, but it is so low to the ground, your feet are never more than like a couple of inches right off the ground there when you're cruising around. But anyways, that's something you're gonna have to decide. Some of it may have to do with the maturity level of your kid or you know, how coordinated they are. I mean, if they're one of those kids who was a late bloomer, they had trouble getting rid of the training wheels, you know, they tend to fall and be a little more clumsy, then you know, you might wanna wait a year maybe before you get them an e-bike. You got a kid who's just a great athlete, tears it up with everything he tries, maybe he's ready to go. So know your kid, know the laws in your state, make that decision yourself. But I personally think it's a great thing for kids. I know it's changed my life. I've lost 20 pounds and been more active than I have in 20 years. So why not start them off early? But all right, guys, hope you enjoyed yourself today. I will show you guys just a little more T18 footage on your way out the door. And as always, I will put a link right underneath this video. We'll take you over to a website where you can go check out more specs and pick one up if you want to do so for yourself. All right, guys, have a great Great rest of your day. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. We got an awesome new e-bike we're going to be taking a look at in a day or two here, so you don't want to miss that. And then go ahead, give us a thumbs up if you think that e-bikes are a good idea for kids, and let me know why or why not down in the comments. All right, see you guys next time. <laughs>